it's Mickey and in today's video I'm going to share with you some of the things that I have been loving in January 2018. So one of the things that I want to do this year is to share with you guys all of my favorite things for at least the quarter or the season. I really love watching these kinds of videos. I just like to see what other people are using and how they use it. So I wanted to share with all of you guys the things that I really depend on to get me through my days. So I will be doing close-ups of all of my favorites and I will list any of the links down below where you can find them. So first up in the category of beauty products that I love would have to be this three-step system by Nexus. It is part of their emergency damage recovery line and it's a shampoo, a conditioner, and a pre-treatment for really dry damaged hair. I know it's not a big surprise to you that I color treat my hair and I heat style it so my hair can really get dry and brittle looking and I was really looking for something to restore my hair and to really heal all those split ends and flyaways. I have used this system every time I've washed my hair this month and it has really made an improvement in the texture and the shine two fashion favorites this month and honestly these two things are probably my favorite all-time accessories. The first one is a crisp white blouse. There is nothing more versatile in your wardrobe than a beautiful tailored white blouse. You can wear them under cardigans like I have on now, under pullovers, under a blazer, tucked in or tucked out. My favorite are these no iron pinpoint Oxford shirts from Land's End. I really love these because they are a, a good weight material. They really take to a crease from your iron and the collars are very crisp. You can pop them up if you'd like and they really stay up. I have been getting my blouses from Land's End for years. I just love them. I think that they wear like iron. They come in a lot of different colors. Of course, white blouses are my favorite. So this is something that I really wear throughout the year, but I love the look of a white blouse under a cardigan in the winter time. So my other fashion favorite are these beautiful black suede boots by Soul Society. I love them so much. I went back and I got a brown pair too. The reason why I love these is that I have a really skinny calf and I just hate the look of my legs swimming in a boot. So the reason why these are my favorite is this suede boot has a beautiful suede panel in the front. The shoe is all suede, but in the back is a panel of microfiber material that really hugs my leg. So it gives it a beautiful sleek look. I like that these boots come up to about the middle of my knee, which makes them the perfect height for dresses and skirts and jeans too. I have two kitchen favorites this month, and the first one is my brand new Keurig. We have come really late to the whole Keurig party. My husband and I really aren't even coffee drinkers, but we thought with all of the hot cider, hot cocoa, and tea K cups out there, it would be great to have around the holidays. This Keurig K250 in Sandy Pearl is a really small machine and I like the way that it looks with my Ray Dunn pieces on my countertop. My favorite K-Cups are these Green Mountain Spiced Apple Cider ones. They are just so delicious. My other kitchen favorite are these spices that I got from Penzi as a gift from a very good friend of mine. I had never heard of this company before so I was really excited to try them because I really love to cook and I love to have really good quality ingredients when I cook. Pensy has been around for over 30 years and they have retail stores nationwide but they do a huge amount of business online. This set has eight different spices in it and I really love the way it was packaged. It had cinnamon sticks and nutmeg and bay leaves and each one of these spices is just so fragrant and potent and really delicious. My next favorite I think would be in the category of planners and notebooks, if that's a category. I'm someone who is very notebook oriented. I always have a notebook with me and my favorite notebooks are those composition books that you can usually find for a dollar, you know, at Walmart. The only problem with those is that they don't look all that great to be carried around with you all day. So I found this just beautiful leather cover on Amazon. It is from a company called Rustic Ridge. Any composition notebook will fit inside and I really like this so much that I even got one for my son 
who uses composition notebooks for everything and just needed something that looked a little bit more put together and professional. Last on my favorites list is a decorating item that was just my favorite this month and that hands down has to be the old door that we found at the Luckett store in Virginia. This is an old vintage farmhouse store that we found at our favorite antique shop called the Luckett store in Luckett's, Virginia. The only thing we really did to it was just bring it home, gave it a good scrub down, and my husband just trimmed the ends so it would fit in the space. I really just love old doors. I have a few of them in my home, and this one particularly is one of my favorites because I think it's just such a good backdrop to decorate for the holidays, and a wreath looks really nice right in the middle of it. So much for watching today as I shared my really short list of favorites for January. So please leave me a comment down below and let me know about the things that were your favorites this month. I always love to hear about new products that I might want to try. I've gained some new subscribers over the last couple weeks and I wanted to welcome you all here. And if you have yet to subscribe, I hope you will on down below. I have so many fun new videos planned in the next couple weeks. So until I see you in that next video, take care of yourself, take care of others, and I hope that you love the life that you have, and I will see you again soon. Bye!